What if Lin-Manuel Miranda saw this? What would he think? Hey, it's Katie and welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I thought I would do something that I have not done before, but I am going to try it. I'm going to try and recreate some of Lin-Manuel Miranda's photos. So these can be like photo shoot photos or photos from like the red carpet, just anything that I find. I love Hamilton, I love Lin-Manuel Miranda, and I love a photo recreation, so this is all my favorite things in one video. Very quickly, if you did not know, I'm trying to reach 10,000 subscribers by my five year YouTube anniversary on April 10. We are so, so close. It's crazy. So thankful for all of your support. You're all incredible and I can't wait to reach 10,000. That's amazing. Okay. Okay. Let's go. So I have all of my outfits laid out. Let's take the photos. So I've now picked my photos, but because Lin-Manuel actually has like a bit of a beard and a bit of stubble and I do not, I found one photo where he's clean shaven. So I'm going to have to do that photo first and then I'll get into trying creating a beard. I'm now just realizing I do not know how to tie a tie. So, this will be a challenge. Bless. Okay, I'm pleased to announce I got something that's not the worst thing in the entire world. Um, it's terrible down the bottom, but you can't see it in the photo, so it doesn't matter. Now in this photo, Lynn, I assume, is actually in like a red carpet or something, so there's lots of people behind him. However, I do not have that. So I'm going to actually take the photo on a white wall and then Photoshop it later. All right, I've added the final details. I've put a wedding band on my finger. I've got a Hamilton playbill instead of the little Hamilton thing he's holding up. And I've got my picture ready. I've set up another camera and we're ready to go. That's a really hard face to do. <laughs> I think we got it. All right, so our next picture is a little bit more low key. It's kind of just wearing my Hamilton shirt, but it does require me putting on a beard. So let's head to my makeup station, as in my chest of drawers with makeup on top of it. So first of all, I'm gonna start by putting my hair up in kind of like his man bun. It's just pulled back. Wow, am I a beauty guru now? <laughs> Lin-Manuel Miranda beauty guru. So in the past I actually made a video where I dressed up as Alexander Hamilton and I turned myself into him and I did do a beard. I think I actually used eyeliner for that however I recently got like an eyebrow gel pen thing um, which I might try to use that so that it actually matches my eyebrow color too. I really am a beauty guru. <laughs> so we've got this um, this and it's got like little bristles on the end so hopefully I can kind of make a little bit out of that. Let's see. Now you may be wondering, Katie, do you have a plan? And the answer is absolutely not, but let's just see how it goes. So it's starting to work, but I am actually going to enlist the forces of my eyeliner pencil just to see if we can get it a little bit better. Spot the difference. Okay, so I was going to take a photo of this outside because I do have like a gray wall like is in this photo. However, I have neighbors. So I'm gonna take it inside and again, do a Photoshop. I think I'm gonna Photoshop all of these because this whole video is just me trying to find creative ways to not go outside. All right, we're going really well. I've got one photo left. Once again, gonna Photoshop the background. So I'm gonna clear off my desk. We're gonna set up the shot. He does actually have his beard in this one, but the flowing mane is out, so I get to wear my hair out, and I can't wait. Let's go. Oh no, I don't have the wedding ring on. Oh, all right, let's go and start again. We got it. Well, I haven't seen them yet because I haven't photoshopped them yet, but here are the final photos. Wow, what did you think? It was a lot harder than I was expecting. I think it might have been a little bit easier if I had like people helping me, but no, it was like me on self-timer. It was me looking at the image. It was me pressing 
the photo and it was me as me. I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure to give it a big thumbs up if you did and let me know down in the comments if you like this sort of video. It's something that you'd want to see again or if you have any recommendations of whose photos I should recreate next. Should I recreate my own photos? Wow. I hope you're having an amazing day and I will see you very soon with a new video. Bye! I need to get this off.